Hey guys, it is Arika Misha, and on today's menu, I'll be cooking whole chicken. Yes, you heard what I said? The whole chicken. So, I'll show you guys my chicken. <laughs> Let me show y'all what I'm going to be using. going to be using the collagen chicken broth. I love that. I've got some seasons back there, guys. Paprika, garlic, salt, um, complete body of complete back there. Um, I've already got my chicken seasons look at that two whole chickens in here guys y'all will see basically all i did was uh cut the chicken in half butterfly it open it up season it on both sides a little oil season how you want to season it i should have did a meal prep on it that's what i should have did but nevertheless let's get into it you guys see i have my two pioneer woman dishes i just want to show you guys my quick easy chicken bake you know just real quick how you can just throw it all in the oven and just cook it real quick. All right, I've got my oven preset to 350 degrees. In case I forget to tell y'all that, 350 degrees. I think I'm going to cook these. I don't know, guys. I want to say an hour, maybe hour and a half. Well, they're not big, giant chickens. They're not like that. But they like that small, small to medium kind of chicken. Anyway, so let's get into it. All right, first thing I'm going to put in here, I'm going to put half of the chicken broth in here. And I'm going to put the other half in my other pan. All right, make sure you guys can see. Pouring the other half over here. Pouring half in one and half in the other. All right, make sure it's even. Nice and even. Okay. Okay. All right. So, we got that all poured in. Let me get my aluminum foil before I forget. All right. Now, I want to sprinkle a little bit of my garlic salt. Just a little bit in there. Because my chicken is already seasoned. Sprinkling a little garlic salt in there. I'd say about a tablespoon and oh let me show you guys the lowry garlic salt and the abadia with complete seasoning sprinkle some of that in there like I said about a tablespoon not too much because our chicken has already been seasoned and it's been marinating overnight it's been in there all day been in there all day guys okay and I have a little paprika Paprika. I only got a little bit left. I got to get me some paprika. Okay. All right. So, let's get our chicken in. Let me show y'all my whole chicken butterfly. A little messy. But we're going to get it up. Okay. Get y'all a close-up. Look at that joker. Nicely butterfly. Just gonna lay it in my pan. Get them arms in there. Go on now, go on. Just a nice, quick, easy chicken bake. Just gonna put it in my pan like that. And as you guys can see, it's already nicely seasoned. Been marinating all day. Okay. Get you positioned. Okay. Down in our broth with that, with those seasons. Kind of moving around to mix my seasons up down there in that broth. Okay. I mean, this is just one, two, real easy. Just the easy way to do it, guys. Easy way to do it. I'm going to go ahead and stretch my chicken out. Get my chicken all nicely stretched out here. Okay, girl. Okay, girl. Go on, girl, do your Pilates. <laughs> Go on, do your Pilates, girl. She is really working it in there. All right. So, stretching them out. All right, let me wash my hands real quick. Okay. 
quick and easy guys okay so we got our chicken in both our pans quick and easy all right now i wanted to show you guys this mix i'm doing i'm doing the family farm pepper sliced bell peppers and onions you can also microwave this but we ain't microwaving it y'all hold on let me get it open i'm gonna throw these on top of our chicken okay so a nice onion pepper mix guys and that orange peppers and the onions are so pretty makes it so beautiful and colorful yes so nice and pretty and colorful we're just going to throw these on top of our chicken so our chicken can get all nicely seasoned with the peppers and the onions yes yes mm -mm -mm. i'll put a couple onions down in that juice too you know so that juice can give a little onion flavor. Okay. I'm going to zoom y'all in. Hold on. Okay. All right. Looking good. Looking good. All right. We got that done. Let's spread it around. Spread the love around. All right. Don't be falling onions. You got to stay on top of the turkey. Okay. Let me zoom y'all in. Hold on. Isn't that so pretty? The orange and white. Isn't that so pretty? Okay. Okay. All right. And I'm just going to throw, I'm going to go just a little of the garlic salt across the top. We put enough season on here. Just going to throw that garlic salt across the top to give us some color. And I'm going to zoom you all in so you all can see. Ooh. Show y'all how pretty that is. Quick and easy and simple, guys. Quick and easy and simple nice take out over to that one isn't that nice see how it sits in that bra okay let me bring you guys back over here bring you guys out of my business Ooh, look at that so pretty so pretty okay now my leftover seasoning juice in my bowl that I have my chicken in I'm put a little hot water in there a little hot water Swish it around, and I'm gonna pour it across the top of my chicken, just to give it some goodness across the top. Okay, yes. Okay. All right, I'm gonna put the lemon pour across the top, guys. Uh, I'm also gonna cook with this. I'm cooking yellow rice and corn, guys. Uh, Y'all know my favorite rice, my Mahatma yellow rice, and I'm doing sweet corn. Sweet corn, guys. I'm going to do two cans of corn and some yellow rice. Uh, I just want the focus to stay on the chicken. You know, just want to show you guys how I cook my quick oven chicken. You know, show y'all how that comes out, how that looks. You know, of course, the sides, chicken and uh, corn and rice. I mean, corn and yellow rice. I cook that a million times. Just want the focus to be on the chicken. Cook whatever size you want to with it. I was going to throw some potatoes in there. With the chicken, I might still do that, y'all. Nah, mm -mm. I've got the rice and the corn. That's enough starch, okay? That's enough starch. All right, so let me get the aluminum foil on top of these. I'm going to throw them in the oven, guys. 350 for an hour, maybe an hour and a half. I'll let y'all know. I'm sure I'll write on the screen somewhere how long it took. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and get them in the oven, guys. And uh, you know what? This is going to be a quick, easy video. I'll be back for the grand finale, guys. I'm going to throw them in the oven. I'll be back. Okay, guys. I just pulled the chickens out of the oven. Y'all know I'm taking y'all in. Yes. They look amazing. Two hours, guys. Two hours to cook. Two hours. Oh. They look amazing too. And you know what I did? I raised the temperature. I cooked them for an hour at 350 and then I raised the temperature to 400 degrees for the other hour. All right, guys. This is Arika Misha. Thank you guys so much for watching, guys. Have a good day. God bless.